Hell, love one. Have no more sorrow, even though we are in the land of sorrow. Chapter 14 of Shadow Dragon, but better. Wonderful map here. Nice little castle indoor map with a ton of stuff to do, a ton of enemies to fight, a uh, ton of treasure to get, a uh, ton of strategies to be had, tons of original raisins on the mic. How's it doing? How's it going? Doing. How's it oh. doing? <laughs> How's it doing? How's it doing? Yeah. How's it uh, doing? No, I'm doing great. How is it doing? How can a raisin how, how commentate this well? I know logging into Discord and all that, and you know, sending my voice over the internet across the Atlantic Ocean. In incredible how I managed to do that. It's really uh -huh. a, a miracle of modern technology. No, it kind of is. But no, we got the the land of sorrow. So we 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 finally get to open a bridge, Mecca. Where where's my bridge key? Oh, do I have a bridge key? I don't actually know if I have a bridge one? key. I have door oh. keys and master keys. Oh goodness! I also we have came a so thief. unprepared. Okay, we have a thief. Yeah, let's just use the thief. Whatever. Yeah, although. I'm glad you brought up master keys because that is one way I think you can open bridges. I actually don't know. Um, think so? Like, I guess like this is always a little funny puzzle to run into with this map. It's like you have this tile here where you want to put a thief or a key user to open up this bridge, but then you can't attack this ballista from two range anymore. So you have to do it at one range, and then you're in range of two armor knights. Which, for example, they two shot Rosado, who's like one of the few units you would think would survive that. Um, because enemies at this point again they have forges, so someone like Titania or Oscar would just get obliterated by this Rider Bane. So. Kind of left with very few options there, and most units that can kill a ballista would be like magical units, and those like Nino, for example, that I'm deploying here, she dies in one hit to a javelin, so I can't put her here and kill this bridge. So uh, the, the funniest way I've, I've figured out to kill this ballista and get past here, turn one, is like having an enemy, having like a unit fight here or open up the bridge, and then warp them away to make to make room for someone else. <laughs> How would you go about this? Uh, yeah, no, I was like, where's my rescue stuff? Uh, I mean, we have a ballista of our own. We can maybe, like, Thunderbolt it, I yeah. guess. That's kind of, like, the first thing that I thought of. Okay, there we go. Yeah, like, I noticed Thunderbolt Jake. does um, 30 damage to this ballista, so you'd be left with 5 HP still. But that make him okay. that make him easier to kill, at least, for sure. And then we have our Longbow, right? Surely oh, you're right. I don't know if that does damage, though. <laughs> does it? I mean... <laughs> the guy has 15 defense. I don't think the Longbow has more than 10 might. Well, I mean, we could use a... a I, I know these words are sinful, but we could use you who's better than Dorothy, right? Like, you, know. <laughs> I could, you could sneak in uh, early Shinon, pretend we pretty earlier, sure. But I wanted to try Dorothy because there's a bunch of Pegasus three questions from here that yeah. I want to snipe with her. And okay. uh, I mean, I benched Gatri, so I don't have like, a lot of other bow users left. I guess Gatri can't use the longbow anyway. Um, I guess I could force the Thunderbolt, but I have a different idea for a forge. Uh, another, another point in this chapter is that you have all these archers here and I think two or three of them have longbows. Two of them, uh, all four, so that they're equally as strong as the silver bows. That's twelve might, and they kind of line up in an annoying way here, where you can't really. It's just annoying to get past, and they protect this fortify healer that keeps healing the enemies, and I want to get rid of them somewhat soon as well. Uh, but I figured out that if you go to Oscar and forge his javelin, he will be able to uh, one round these archers. He'll need like plus two might on the javi, so I think that's like a good investment on him, and also just does some like just you know. Be, be stronger. It'll be. It'll look good on his resume if he does that. Yeah, so, we get a, a stronger javelin. Just seems like time, you know. It's, it's not Tellius, but it's his time. Yeah, just Ronan on Tellius character, no big deal. Does of course mm. mean this won't go towards solving the whole problem with the battle station and the bridge and the uh, armor knights, but I'm sure we'll find a way. There we go. That Two strengths. Not like that's the only problem. Six res. Holy. Yeah, he he mage cutter now. He's, he's, he's got some a lot res. of numbers. Yeah. And there was something else I wanted to give him, but I don't remember what it was. A forge, that's right. I'm going to forge his javelin. I guess we could also energy drop it. It would also solve the problem. Oh, true. I don't remember. Energy drop. This. I guess we can just do this. This is good. We can, forge it, it, right? we can forge a thunderbolt. Oh, there we go. Wait, okay. yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, problem solved. Let's see, 24 attack is not enough. I think he might need a little bit more. 24, 17? That's enough, isn't it? That is enough. What about this guy? I think, 16. I think he misses one, but it's a long ah, guy <laughs> anyway, so who cares? Yeah, yeah, it doesn't matter. Alright, Oscar, consider yourself energy drops. 24 attack, yeah, I don't know, it works out. I like it, I like it. Alright, so he's that. That's this is him. what that comment section meant when they told us to drop Oscar. Yeah, okay. <laughs> uh, in that case, I guess we can force the Thunderbolts. Let's do that. Uh, it's only got 8 uses left, but again, there's not that many Blisses left anyway. Like, how much might do we need on this? We only need just two. two, right? We need two for this ballista. We might need a little bit more for future, so I, I guess four is the final number. I think we get some money in this chapter too. Get some mid hate on it. Uh, do we have any funny lightning signs? Can we make lightning out of the characters here? Can we? What is this, like infinite craft? Like, <laughs> Wait, what is this? Oh, let's see what this is. 
Oh, that's a semicolon and then something else above it. Not really, does it? That's not really lightning, no. is it? Uh, it's like that looks like clouds with rain, like the rain did. clouds. Yeah, like see, like do it again, do it again. Uh, was it this? Uh, no, you use the uh, like the curly thing to the left of it, like the little Cheeto to the left of it. <laughs> the Cheeto. Yeah. I'm glad years of education in English were not lost on your reasons. Yeah, no. Like this? No, 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 no. Like that and the colon. Ah, why is this? Forging is like the hardest part of this game. Yeah, uh, no. Also because... So this is semicolon, right? Yeah, that's semicolon. for this one. And then the, this. Yeah, and then Cheeto. Or like the uh, the sem semicolon works here too. But see, it's like rain clouds, kind of. Yeah. Let's do, let's do a little bit of this, a little bit of that. And and then we can imagine from the rain clouds come a thunderbolt later, right? That's what we can do. Yeah, it's either that or we can like try to improvise for all. I guess this is kind of like a thunderbolt. Oh, almost. true. Wow. What are these called again? <laughs> Brackets? Uh, oh, that, that, that's a that's a hot contest. People don't oh, know what no. these are called. I didn't mean to open up a can of worms like that. Yeah, no. I mean, I, I think Americans call the the curvy ones parentheses and then the <laughs> curvy, curvy ones. Brackets. The, I, just, but, I think you said but curvy, I, but I heard curvy ones. Oh, the Kirby ones? Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. There we go. Perfect porch name. Good luck, comment I mean, section. There we go. <laughs> Good luck us pronouncing it, too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got that problem solved, too. Now we can we can bunga in there. Uh, I benched some uh, favorites like Titania because it was really too easy with them. So we're going to make it a little bit harder. Figure out a bit of a plan we could do with Geese's water walking. We need Rickard for some stealing. Some mm -hmm. physics supports from uh, Pangeo and, and Micaiah. Uh, Rosado is here because, of course, he knows here because it's been a while since we've seen her. The sweet wing might have to go on like Felix instead. Uh, have him to play as well, I think. Yeah, he's Felix, here. The goat. Look the at the goat, goat, exactly. Oh, or did you mean you know? I mean, both of them, really, when you think about it. Both of them, yeah, really, this whole army, right? Both, both the whole, so. the whole, no one's left out here. Yeah, both both of the people in this army. like <laughs> Both of uh... All right, let's get it. King Jewel. That's the guy we saw in Prologue. Wait, really? I think so. Marth needs to go to this uh, village to pick up a Thoron Tome, so that's what we're going first. And I think that means we can use his support with Jake, although I'm not sure how built it is. So do the Thunderbolt. There we go. 80 Thund. hit. There we go. Get out of here. Always hits. I think I had animations off because of saves coming last time, so I'm sorry you didn't get to see Pikachu there. Skill! <laughs> and Stone Hoist. See if we can hit with it. But we did just level skill, right? So, you know. Yeah, we will hit with it. Uh, just checking. I think everyone is on. That should be on besides Micaiah. And then we can... Right, so now we can either open a bridge this turn, and then put someone here that takes both hits, which I don't think anyone does. Or we can put someone to bait the javelin first and then go in next turn. What do you think? Uh, that sounds okay. Surely we have someone who survives both hits, right? Like someone we can like javelin down one of the guys, maybe like javelin down the Rider's Man boy, or what? Yeah, I think what we can do is like we can throw Odin, say, here, below Jake, where he's in range mm -hmm. of the javelin, and that will counter the hit. Oh, true. And then next turn, we can go in on the other guy and have a talk between uh, Nino and Odin, the mages as they Apparently. are. And they have to talk about magic things. We'll course, never get it. Most of the enemies in this chapter are passive, but what we can do, I think, is bait out a javelin guy with Bartre and prepare Geese to water walk hammer one of the guys, can open it. Whoa! And then he, plan. Can, he can get the other one in any phase, and everyone else kind of advances forward. Have a... Saffron is scary. Was this like a physics somewhere in the map? It's, it's the fortify. It has global range. So anytime you weaken an enemy below half, I think they do their thing. But if you don't weaken anyone below that, I don't think anyone gets healed. I think they just idle in that case. So that hmm. should be our chance. Does he drop the fortify or...? No, unfortunately I don't think he drops the fortify. I think it's dropped later. I don't remember mm. when you get a fortify in this game. I know you're very, you really want to get that fortify. I do. <laughs> Ask about it for two chapters, <laughs> which I get. It's a good staff. It's a good staff. But don't worry, we'll get it eventually. Is and... the square to the right better? Yeah, I'm Fewer thinking... longbows can attack it. Yeah, that's what I'm wondering about too. Global range is not helping here, right? So he's definitely getting attacked by these two, which we want. And then there's okay. longbow here, longbow here. So this silver bow is probably out of the question. And this, there's like this one, he doesn't want out anyway. So I guess if we're out of range of this, then he's getting attacked four times by 23 attack. So that's like nine damage each. That's like doable yeah. for him. And, you, and your square was better anyway, so. Was it? The, the, the square you were looking at was better anyway. Just because it's further in? Yes, and like I, I was thinking about reducing the number of three range squares that they could use to attack you, but like they, 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 they can't do that anyway. They can't even reach that far right square. 
Okay. Well, hopefully he can counter one longbow. I don't think it will happen, though. And Rosado on reserve here, I guess. I think Rosado's gonna end up flying over the water once his armors are gone. And uh, help be the thief to the treasure. Uh, you can't see... Oh, I fucked up. No! Right. No! I moved her to the wrong square just to do the talk! Let's see if everything else works, works out, though. You move Baited up. Baited by the dialogue? Yeah. I was just trying to reunite two friends. Also, let me see if the Fortified Priest does indeed not move. I guess what might happen is Oscar weakens that one guy that he doesn't want around and then the, the Fortify uh, triggers anyway, which would be sad. But Oscar, uh, he's doing his work. He's doing his job. Get in there, Oscar. Ooh. All right. Saving Forge Javelin use. Actually, not Forge Javelin uses. The fake Forge Javelin. Yeah, saving energy drop uses, I guess. Like. <laughs> saving energy drop uses. Okay, yep, he's all good. And then these move. And that's it. That's all the moves in turn one. Okay, let me let me okay. re let me readjust that to make sure that it actually works the way int I intended it. To make sure we keep Nino, yeah. Mm hmm Hopefully. No! Oscar! No! We reset the map! No! No, 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 no. Unacceptable. 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 It must be redone. 33-7. There you go. That's that's the ones. That's the ones. Okay. Okay, this time, everything should be just right. Right? Odin Dank. Oh, come on, dude. Why can't you double these? Rolled high on speed. He did. Or he rolled low before. Which room? Okay, Oscar working as intended. Not missing the benchmarks this time. Maybe I should have forced that javelin after all. God. Or oh. some plus hit. Yeah. Oh well, it's not like our. It's not like he drops the fortify. So it's not like we care about him using using all the uses. It's fine. Yeah. Okay. Now we can start killing longbows. Although he's kind of dangerously low on health, so he probably shouldn't attack this turn, unless we have time to physic him twice, which I'm not sure if we do. Think we do physic him. I mean, probably physic him at least once. Yeah. I think we can do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. This guy got fortified, so we'll have to need. I think we have Rosado Hammer, the second one. I was kind of hoping to feed both kills to Geese. Just for fun. Does he have better... To show it off. Yeah. yeah. Rosado has higher defense, lower HP, so I'm not sure if Geese will get attacked over him. I was hoping Ken Opener would be a one-shot, but clearly we need to forge even more might on it. Uh, this doesn't really work. And then this time is not a problem. I guess... Hmm, what if you, like, try to stun hoist the guy or something? Oh, No way, right? Or, like, hoist flum. Yeah, that's a good idea. Uh, we should have room for that. So we're definitely gonna like open up the bridge this turn. If we don't, we're just like lost farming gamers. Yeah, like we just this guy's gonna die. Anything. So don't worry about him. Watch out for these guys though. Ooh, Silver Lance. Yeah, they should we some... unmark the Armonite range on the right because we'll be killing him, right? So yeah. Good okay, idea. that's nice. I think he doesn't have range, so we can probably do like Felix into Odin or something. Well, not unless we heal Odin. Mm -hmm. Altena doesn't do a whole lot. Altena kind of not as great as I was hoping she would be. Mm. All right, I can move Odin out of the way, and then Thanny toast this one. He'll just be gone. I don't have to worry about him anymore. But that does cost me a physic use this turn. Um, yeah, I guess we can start seeing if this hits. Voice farm on this guy. Nice. Nice work, Jakey. Mm -hmm. And then you get in here and open this can of worms. It's the right side covered. You don't kill from here by two points. Oof. Maybe we don't even bait the cat. Maybe we don't even bait this guy. This Maybe we don't fight that guy this turn. We just let him come to us with like Felix. Yeah, we just kill him from the range. Yeah. Felix, and we'd be good. However, that works. I mean, maybe you still need to put a guy in front of Felix. Like, yeah, if we all, like Altana lives, then we maybe put Altana in front. Yeah, that works too. I wonder if Altana kills this guy in here with iron. She does. Okay, you do oh, that. Yeah. Not too bad. Not too bad. And then she misses. Oops. Yeah, oopsie. <laughs> now we can heal Odin and put him in range of one calf, maybe. Uh, no, that's not nah, anything that overlaps with these guys is just like toast for us. I think it's not great. Uh, 
I guess Oscar can bomb and then fight one more person. Uh, we could. What if we put him like here in this forest, and then he? Ooh, sure, yeah. The longbow probably won't see a square to attack him from because this guy is kind of like not gonna move from that tile in order to attack him, and then this guy can't attack him anyway. Yeah, so if we just put him there, then mm -hmm. you know we can just wall. Makes yeah. sense. There's a chance if we do that that we get attacked by three of them though, so we should be prepared for this by like using physic perhaps. Yeah, I think we physic him and volning, and then he gains like ten plus something, like around ten probably HP. And it should be yeah. enough to survive three more hits. And then exactly. This problem, be, this problem should disappear from there. And, and, and the other side, there's a chance really. There's like a guarantee one way or another. It's just we weren't paying attention to the detail that we needed to have paid attention mm -hmm. to. Yeah, what's so. his health the way he is? Maybe you can attack. This? No, he's like exactly getting killed, right? Shucks. All right. Take this okay. Vuln. That's why we bought all those vulnerabilities in the Rad chapter, right? Yep. Sure did. Okay, so Altena's getting attacked. Not super productive. Uh, let's... Now we can have to talk, I guess. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't think with the Speedway makes sense anymore on Hino. She's like fine with doubling. Maybe Odin takes the Speedway now. Yeah, no. More Odin. And I kind of want to heal Odin first, though, before we wing him. We're never going to get to the speed win. Yeah, it's just going to be the trade around forever. What or happened to uh, Rosado? Is he going in or is he not going in? Uh, he can't survive two hits right now. Um, well, I mean, he can just like kind of bypass this Armor Knight, right? Just yeah, kind of he forget can, he exists. He can fly by, equip the hammer, and then this Armor Knight, I don't know if he'll attack him or someone else. Hmm. But oh, I want these calves right. down here. Yeah, they do 28. Ooh. I just don't go in range of the calves, you know? 28 is 15. Minus two ish, probably. So I don't think he kills the calves, or either the calves kill him in combination with the armor knight. So I guess don't get rid of the calves is the right thing to do. Yeah, we could, it like, be simple. We could hand axe so that if he does get attacked, the, 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 the kill can still go to geese. Oh, yeah, good idea. And Barter will have to walk his way here, and I guess someone needs healing. We're gonna feed, we're gonna, oh, we already physic Oscar, so we can heal Bartre or Felix's turn. Let's heal Bartre. <laughs> Warp Bartre, no. Yeah. <laughs> Get warping onto the fort. I'm ready. Yeah. I mean, he does have the gym helper. Okay, so heal him by warping him onto the fort, right? There yeah. <laughs> it's double duty. Two birds Ooh. with one stone. Here he comes. Oh, we still don't kill. What the heck? Brad, he wasn't weakened. That sucks. That's such a bad use of the can opener. <laughs> to weaken an armor knight? Well, to weaken an armor knight so that the enemy will always use fortify. Oof. Oh, true. I mean, how much will the Fortify heal, right? Like, it's Not just... enough to get out of range of the Can Opener. That's right. It's that's mostly true, just true. a waste of the Can Opener. And, I mean, at least he's killing all these Silver Bowl guys. That's good. There you go. Yeah, that's true. All good. We can Physic. Yeah. And this is nice for Marth, who can ask to walk by here. He probably won't be in range of much, because he can, like, hide a little bit. But not only be in range of one Longbow guy. Oscar, you still don't live, right? Yeah, no, you still don't live, so... Yeah, no. I mean, it's a... I kind of want Oscar to go right. Physics. He's our he's our anti-sniper guy too, so kind of want him to go where Rosado is to fight that sniper. Hmm. I mean, I guess so. But like, once we kill the thieves, the treasure room isn't very urgent, right? So we can move him over there in time. True. The question... are there, wait, are there reinforcements? Let me check. Yeah, I, could, I, I think it's just the Pegasus Knights from the Catria Palace spot, and that's like turn number eight. Yeah. Oh, right. I, I remember you were like, there's some, you know, Pegasus reinforcements I want to shoot down. I'm like, dude, those are recruitable. Like, <laughs> there is a recruitable. What are you talking about? Okay. Among others, there is a recruitable. Odin has... I think he has the bulk to take one cab, not two. And unless I'm reading the map wrong, I think he gets attacked by two unless I put someone adjacent to him. So let's put someone adjacent to him. There you go. And then he sword hands. Yeah, you I think just we use the save point or something. I think we unequip the sword hand after he does this. Mm -hmm. So that he doesn't suffer from success. I think so too. And maybe we have Jake use the save point. Yeah, maybe. Never mind, that's like the best spot for Jake anyway. Like look at that thing. Look at that massively fortified position. Mm -hmm. Is the self point like in our in our camp again? That one? Oh it's, it's here. It's like a very weird spot. Yeah, no. Yeah, if we want to keep Dorothy moving, then that's probably... It's either that or, like, Recurve does it. This is in range of a uh, longbow guy, if we don't kill him right Ooh. now. Well, guess... we have physics, right? So Yeah, I guess we could physic Oscar again. Mm -hmm. And kill the longbow guy, and then make that stop. Um, this is in range of longbow. 
The frog doesn't kill Micaiah? It doesn't kill Micaiah. So it wouldn't be like the worst thing in the world. I guess if one in here is good to make sure Geese doesn't die. So we Physic on Oscar? Oscar. Oscar, though. Level up on Micaiah? Oh, magic speed? What? Any Since level up. when? Uh, the Oscar does not, speed. in fact, kill this one, so... Wait, does he? Leave him be, I guess? Well, that's what the stone hoist is. I don't know. I got nothing. Oh. Mm -hmm. I mean, you keep saying stone hoist as if it's going to hit, but we have hoist flum. Come on. Oh, we have hoist flum. Yeah, that's what the hoist flum is for. Hoist I mean, flum. surely we have some other character who can do the save point. Like, I don't know. Card. Yeah, once, he's, once, the armor, uh, once the archer is gone, surely someone else can do this. I do think... I'm not sure... Do you know when Katria and Pala appear? Uh, it says four. turns 8 to 15. Okay, so we have some time for Marth to get to the village, and then... I'm not sure if I want him to like go down this route, because this is very awkward for fighting the Pegasus Knights, whereas this makes it very easy to kill them with whoever you want to. So I want to get him to the village and then walk him back through these forests, basically. Yeah, I don't know if we might down. even want to like send Pendray or Makai over there with the Warp Staff to just like get him out of there. That would be the other option, yes. I kind of like that idea, too. Altena... Ah, she fell off. I guess not enough level ups. Also, the level ups she get, did get were kind of bad. Yeah, true. They just didn't have stats. Do we maybe like heal? I was about to say Rucker, but this is Felix. Do we maybe like heal Felix and just like put him next to Odin and he's the yeah. guy who's next to Odin? I understand he's doing that with um, Altena. Uh, we could glue factor to kill a Cav, actually. I don't know why I'm checking Iron Axes. She doesn't one hit Kyoto, so that's still four to five big. Oof. She also doesn't survive two hits. I think. Um, I'm fine with either of these characters taking a hit. I think if Altana vaults, she might be able to survive anyway without a heal. Nah, it's 34. This is 17 and 18, right? Yeah, okay, but we just put her in a position where she only takes one, right? I just put her here. Oh, uh, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Oh. Yeah, why, why didn't I think of that? You're right. There you go. Oh, I should have switched to Odin's weapon. Let me just do that now. Uh, I guess I'll save with um, the card before I forget. And then switch up with Bartray. Give him the fire. And then heal. I guess I'll just use this turn to heal Felix. And then this was gonna be a geese kill. It's promise. gonna be 90. It's okay, we have the save point, right? So it's true. Yeah, he's not gonna miss, trust me. Let's see if there's something fancy I can do with Felix to we'll make it so I don't have to use this uh like I'm almost out of cans. <laughs> this <laughs> open. All right, we've almost opened all the cans on now. We've only killed like 19 armor knights with this thing. Yeah. And Does he live too? One, two, There's four, auto? five, six. Okay. Um, technically, if Cav ends up here, we can trade the Jim Halperts to him, mm -hmm. <laughs> and he can kill a Cav. But I think it's just gonna be Rosado show for these Cavs. If he can take two, which I don't think he does. Oh, just barely. Does just it. like, well, no. If he one rounds from two range, he does, right? Oh, so. you're right. Totally right. I don't think I want to block the thieves. I don't think it'll matter if I do. I think these are very passive thieves, but just in case. All right, good yeah. idea. I like it. There we go. There we go. Bonk. Stonk, stonks. Nice. Axe playing so... Telius, really. Mm -hmm. One rounding with hand axes. Energy drop on Oscar with a forged javelin. It's there all the same. Know. It's all the same. Felix, heal. Dorothy, come down. Goes for Odin, doesn't kill him, Sword right? Ooh. Okay, all right, good. Don't double him either, thank you. Okay, nobody doubles anybody. Yep. Let's all chill, let's all not double each other. Hey, speed. Oh, the speed. This is why we didn't use the speed wing, right? Exactly. Now he still doesn't get doubled or double anyone. The speed wing will not change that. Maybe he's not the speed wing target. Maybe he's not the chosen one. Maybe we don't choose him, that makes him not the chosen one. Whoa. Well. I think last chapter, Rosada was just barely not one shotting the thieves with the songs. That probably won't change. Who are they fortifying? Oh, the two caps. Okay. Uh, yeah, I was just about to ask the same mental question. I was like, the answer to this is probably obvious. I'll shut up. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. This. Okay. One thief dies and one thief does not die. Does the other thief make it to the door? Uh, if you block their way, they don't like neither. But if they. Yeah, okay. So the second thief doesn't. But if he ends up here while not being killed, it's kind of dire, isn't it? Well, you just kill him the same way, right? Like, so, Felix can not help out, I think. Yeah, so, I think he can, right? Well, so that, you're saying we kill this one, and then this one doesn't make it to the door, right? Yeah. 
But then, what do we do once he's in front of the door with a sniper behind it, and we can't really I, kill with Rosado? Uh, oh, um, good point. I didn't think it that far. Two, uh, how five, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, Felix does help. Okay. Does he? Because use Felix. Yeah. Oh, because the thief ends up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh yeah, he ends up here, right? Mm -hmm. uh, also, we have like Levin Sword too, right? So that could hit. Yeah, that's, I was already trying to factor in Levin Sword. So the thief will be two square squares from the door. So yes, Felix is here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, yeah, he's easily able to reach even with the one range weapon. So yeah, we can kill this other thief. Even if not, the save point doesn't take us that far back, so it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. You're right. Perfect. Silver sword? The uh, silver sword. Felix already has one of those, so we don't have to worry about that. A sword whose might yes. offsets its steep price. Yeah. Me about all my forges. <laughs> uh, Ricardo needs to go that direction. Some people gotta move out of the way. You know, we can double these, so let's have her do that. She can double them? What? Of course. Holy. She doesn't kill Dude, with Nino thunder. Good. You know, excellent. I'll take this one out. Oh, the no crit. She did kill with thunder. <laughs> it turns out. Uh, I mean, like technically, we can Thanny Toss. Just shocking the world. Oh, oh she's so please, good. She's yes. So good. Offenses and HP. Yep. I don't know. Um, We're still waiting for the day when Nino HP is like relevant. Let's be real. <laughs> okay, we can kill with Dorothy here. That's all I'm asking. Mm -hmm. Dorothy like Parthia. Bartria. Yeah. Ooh. Bartria and put into Partria. Nothing, there's nothing here, right? Yeah, this is a complete square. It's just completely empty. We conquered the next save points. It's all coming together. Parthia. You Doesn't mm. double XP in this game. For shame. Ah, that's a, such trash. What the heck? We could have gotten, like, another 30 EXP to see that level faster. Mm -hmm. Like, man. <laughs> You reckon we send Dricker to this door first and then have him go through to the treasure room so that everyone else doesn't have to wait for door keys? I guess uh, we can that, buy door keys there anyway. That does sound right. However, does that make the Pegasus problem easier or harder? Like, because what question. if we just left that door closed the whole time and forced him to go the long way around, except for on oh, the left side? I usually of the map, just so go work. here because it's also the most direct path to the throne room. So, like, I'm oh, going to go here. So, I don't think the Pegasus will ever interact with the door being open or not. Okay. The way I play it, anyway. I don't know what you did in your playthrough. That's right. I just went far right. <laughs> you know what? That's fair. Uh, having a ballista in range will be nice for the things. I'll put you in a spot where you can be healed. You say it was... Is it turn 8, Katra and Pelia? Pelia? Uh, turn 8 through 15, yes. Yeah. Before Pelia, I guess. Mm -hmm. Okay. Marth, go get a nice toe from this village. Hey. It's Camus. It's Camus. Camus. It's Camus from Fire Emblem Gaiden. No, that's question mark, question mark, question mark, obviously. Uh, sorry, I can't read. We'll never know who that is. Uh, do you think Jake can assassinate this uh, priest? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, he, if the priest doesn't see Jake's moves, then he totally can. Surely, right? Surely. I mean, they've never been that smart. Do we ever? S I think we sent these back to the left, right? He has no business being here with the sniper or the, the, the thieves. He's never going to hit those. I think so. Probably all hands on deck. All right. For oh, this, yeah. On deck. What, what was that move? Oh, he sees he's... Felix's range, probably. No, he doesn't. He's... he's just an idiot. What? He's just completely given up. Like, <laughs> this is a free Vuln. You're just free points. Whoa. Uh, you ever... What was that from? Like, Spike Kids 3D or something? Uh, You're just free points. Oh, okay, Rosado. I guess the kills <laughs> will not be shared. Sorry. It's a copy pasta. I'm trying to think of where I found it first. 27. I'm gonna see it if sounds like a matchup here. It, it sounds like one of those things that like someone would say to act like a gamer, but they're not a gamer. You know what I mean? Yeah, they more like, like more like a child than anything else. Yeah. Well, I mean, like. Oh, it's it's from a Weedle to Weedle video. Oh, okay. It's um, some guy being like rude and Pokemon Showdown. That's what it was. Okay, Mikai, I got A ranks tabs, so we too can fortify now. What Whoa. do you do here? Okay, that's that's good, I guess. Aerospace. Okay, we could do like um, post plum to aerospace, I guess. What if the priest will move out of the way now? No way, right? Ooh. Jakey, keep on going, Jakey. With all this free skill. EXP and skill levels, skill Holy. levels, skill level infinite. 
Okay, and Altina. I guess Altina can like try to buy a Dorky to beat <laughs> beat them to it. Oh, they just sell Dorkies here. That's handy. Yeah. Um, um, dang. I'll just use the speed wing because otherwise I'm gonna keep forgetting it and everyone will go insane. Mm -hmm. Imagine, like, building a castle and fortifying it, and, like, we're gonna defend this castle, and then just, like, literally right outside your door, a merchant just shows up selling the key to the castle, like, yeah. <laughs> and, I, and, like, for cheap, too, like... <laughs> 50 gold that you can get inside this castle and anywhere you want, really. Yeah, it's like, dude, really? <laughs> Bruh. Okay, Oscar can still rust, but to the right side. Let's do that. Although, I would like him to get healed first, so maybe just go through here so we can mend him. There we go. He can go the other way through the door. Are we really going this way? I'm not saying like really going this way since it's a horrible idea, but we said we weren't going to do it last time. It's actually yeah. a good idea to go this way, isn't it? Going down? Yeah, surely okay. we make it there in time. Well, okay, so you said they, they appear on any new phase turn 8, right? So 5 yes. is here, mm -hmm. um, and the start of 6 will still be here. And then... Uh, see, they appear on any phase, so turn Let's five... find out where we're at at the start of 7, right? Come again? So, well, where are we at at the start of seven? Yeah, like, so he has nine move and he takes two to get through a forest, right? So, one, two, mm -hmm. three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, this is the start of turn six? Seven. Six, seven. Okay, so we're here. Mm -hmm. Well, it's fine because he, he, he can talk to the Pegasus Knights. It's just they need to be get oh, out true. of range next turn. Like, the Pegasus Knights will talk to him. They won't suicide. So, it's fine if he's like in range of them. That's That's pretty handy. Next wave is the bad, it's the bad plan. Well, let's, let's roll with it. Next wave oh. is one. Wait, what? <laughs> what? Hello there. <laughs> well, um, um, I mean, I'm not afraid of these, <laughs> but the next ones are actual enemies. So, so uh, I, I mean, think, maybe. I, I think we put like Altena here or something to bait the next wave into our direction here and have Marth run away for a bit. I, I think so. I mean, maybe they mean that. The enemy reinforcements show up on turn eight. Yeah, that's what I you think know? they mean. That's why I was like, because I all I saw on Wad was the normal ones, not Pella and, and Katria. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah. What if there's just a save point we can use? Like, you know, there is a save point right here. I would prefer to use it after we get like a good level up or something, but maybe this calls for desperate measures. That's true. Like save point, and then just run Marthen. Run in. Like, surely. Oh, yes. true. There's not going to be reinforcement this turn. You're right. Okay. Hmm. You have my interest. Okay. I'm done. Um, let's go. In that case, I'm going to move a couple units. I mean, they're not going to appear, right? Pretty sure. Okay. Whatever. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Perfect. The oh, fuck? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I, tr I trust in the plan. I trust in the plan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. I trust in the plan. Surely this works. Surely this works. Okay, the door's still closed, but no worries. We can buy a door key. Lara Bell. Massive uh, trade chain it, trade chain it over by exactly. like Oscar and someone else. Exactly. I don't know what else Yo, I need. Pure water? Do we have pure waters or no? I have one pure water. I've never used it. We have a barrier mm. staff that I always never used too. Okay, yeah, well, if I we heal, have those and we don't use them. I'm gonna heal the Bosker. I thought you said heal the boss. I was like, what? No, we're going the wrong way. Like, We can't open the door this turn with Altena and Oscar. Let's open the door this turn then with Altena and Oscar. All right, I will open the door this turn with Altena and Oscar. Okay. All right. We've got to run the same page here. <laughs> this guy doesn't reach me, so let's go in. This is a good example of like, how empty Shadow Dragon maps can be sometimes, and why they kind of rely on reinforcements to fill up the enemy count. Here. Just cross over. Yeah, there's like kind of a massive scrap at the start, and then it's like, all right, cool. All right, that's it. That's the whole so, map. Enjoy. It's like those. I'm trying to like. I can't really think of an example right now, but there's some Fire Emblem maps where like all the enemies are aggressive, or a very large number of the enemies are aggressive, like straight away. So this is like massive protracted battle at your spawn point, basically, mm -hmm. and then they're all dead except the boss, who's like way off in the distance. Like, all right, here I come. It's like <laughs> a contrast between um, FV8, F5X. And FE, what's it called? Uh, awakening maps, basically. Mm -hmm. like yeah, yeah, stones, yeah. Uh, skirmishes, I guess. Anyway, uh, two new units. I don't remember which is which, but one of them is new. Do you remember? Uh, Katri is new because Palo was unchanged. Yeah, that's right. Uh, we have Est. <laughs> <laughs> Early Est, okay. Right. So, Est. 
<laughs> this is probably yeah. where I have to talk about the uh, Est Catria replacement conspiracy that uh, I don't remember who it was, but someone floated on subreddit and P. Vladios, who submitted Est, subscribed to it. Uh, the theory is that Est and Catria were, in some ways, had their stats and levels swapped around in a way that was bad for Est in future games, but good for Catria and her reputation. The way it works is that in FE1, Est and was level 5, while Catria was level 3. And then from future games, in every future game, Est ended up getting worse and worse off in like all the remakes and like SOV and Gaiden and New Mystery and all that stuff. S does end up getting the short end of the stick every single time, but this is S that she was truly intended for. FE1 version with her FE1 portrait, uh, Rider's Bane in her inventory. I don't know if that's true, but you know what? It's a good weapon, so we'll, we'll go roll with it. Look at those growths. 70% strength, 70% skill, 70% speed, 60% luck. Who cares about the rest? All these are really good. Um, sure, she has low bases because she's an S, but she's only left five level for promotion. So this is why I said that Rosado was not the only Pegasus Knight in the game, because you know, we get a couple of other ones. And we could either have S go the Wyvern route, use a Matchless Hue and have plus five strength and defense or whatever it was that she gets. Or we can be cool, use our Elysian Whip to promote her. And then we can have a Falcon Knight. I'm not sure actually if I have my Elysian Whip still. I might have sold it for Forward Greed, but that is something you can do if you're not dumb, dumb like I am. Maybe you have an extra flyer that can kill stuff, and in a meta game where reclassing is not an option, having a base flyer class is pretty good. So, sure, you have to deal with a low base strength, but you have B-rank lances, um, and you have effective weaponry. You can make it work if you want to, you get another flyer. I think this is a good unit if you like a training project and you want to have some fun with it. What do you think? Yeah, I mean, the, the growths are pretty tremendous, as you can see, right? Like, at 70 strength, 70 speed is, like, quite large, and even... 50, even 50% 50 HP isn't to isn't anything to sneeze at either. It's kind of hard for me to really like get on board with the whole like if you need an extra fire, here's one pal type of uh, analysis or type of idea without seeing Palo first because like that's also true of Palo when the Palo is just better. Mm -hmm. But uh, or or a Palo replacement or whatever whatever the Palo no, is. Palo's, I just said Palo generic. <laughs> Palo okay. Palo. Yeah. Wait, can I actually see Palo or no? Uh, if you want to, you can see Palo. Okay, like one point of strength better, I guess, and like a point of defense better. Yeah, I don't it's know. not not a big difference, honestly. No, yeah, like Pal has way worse growths. Like Catch yeah. has good growths, but Pal does not really. Honestly, what's the point? Like you know, just use Est. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Just use Est. <laughs> Who cares? We'll uh, we'll see that one point of strength matter every time we use Est, right? <laughs> like we need the we, sure. we need the swear jar, except it's the Est strength jar. I, but she levels it up once, and who cares? Yeah, the, the big difference in the base game between Catria and Pala is that Pala has B, B lances, whereas Catria has C, and so there's like a couple weapons that Pala can use that Catria cannot, and she has like a bit of extra hit, and I think might, but in this case, mm -hmm. that doesn't apply, that's just, that's just there. Uh, Pala's good too, but I'm not going to use her because I want to use replacement units instead. So we'll fly, I think we fly right, because they, they spawn like here? Uh, from those two squares, yeah, it's hard for me to remember. It just says from the squares that Pala and Catria spawned, but like, are we supposed to remember that? It happened so fast. <laughs> yeah, they, 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 uh, they spawn and then fly away. It's the bottom two. It's like... Oh, so it's here? That's a lot yes. more convenient. Okay, so... It's those two. I think it's like, uh, one range weapon and then Javelin? Or is it both have Javelins? Uh, gosh, I don't know. Let me take okay. a look. I don't, I don't know. What doesn't either. Yeah, what doesn't... Yeah. Um, well, let's fly away and hope for the best, I guess. There you go. Pala dies, I'm gonna need to reset over it. <laughs> Nah, just whatever. Right. If S dies, though. Yeah, no, that's 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 when we gotta cry. Importance. I'm actually not sure if she gets. She does get weighed down with the Rider's Bane to like low speed, so this should let her take one hit if I unequip it. And then we can have Odin and Bartry sponge some hits. Bartry might get doubled by generic Pegasus Knights. Might not. Geese might be better off than Bartry. Slightly more speed. Kind of the same bulk. Kind of. Opium? Kind of, not really. Alright. Peace. And... Alright, Oni, you got this. Don't die. And Oscar goes on a mission to fight a sniper. So no one else can do it. And... I have opened a door for him. That's good. Uh, Rickard is gonna go treasure hunting. He's not needed here anymore. Uh, this priest has a mend, not a fortify. We don't have to worry about that. Rosado, can I guess get started on the throne? Or we can leave that to Geese or whoever wants to get the XP. Maybe it's time for some more Bartra XP, honestly. But he won't be needed here, mm -hmm. maybe. Dorothy gets to shoot some people, of course. You know, can use the save points next turn, potentially. Hopefully. 
Yeah, I guess I'll bait over an enemy with Altena and then send them to help out. I'll just actually I can kill the Armonite with Nino next turn. That seems like a good use of our spare time. It should be easier, right? Yeah. Altena will do a little bit of chip. And then Nino will do 21. 20 times 2. I want to say with a little bit of extra chip from Altena and or Rosado, we can get there. Have Rosado in a flex spot. Andreo. You can just go anywhere, yeah. Yeah. You know, go down. Okay, plus, like, it's not even that turn yet, right? It's not even that turn. It actually is that turn. What turn is it? Turn 8? It's your 7. Okay. So it should be, like, almost that turn. They didn't come. Well, they didn't appear. That doesn't mean Phantom Wiki is wrong, for what it's worth. <laughs> Does Phantom Wiki said to spawn turn seven? That's right. Phantom Wiki, I thought you bettered your life. Oh, that's right. I thought they really cleaned up their act. Yeah. I trusted you, Phantom Wiki. I never did actually trust Phantom Wiki. You never did. You never did. Actually, been very outspoken about your distrust of Phantom Wiki, I will admit. <laughs> How dare you insinuate that I would not trust Phantom Wiki? <laughs> Uh, okay, so Rosado plus Nino will kill here. We just have to worry about, you know, them dying afterwards. So let's try not to do that. What about uh, Nino plus Altena with the hand axe? Altena plus Rosado in the square. E rank axes. <laughs> oh, never mind. Javelin? I don't know. Like, where's my forged javelin? <laughs> uh, I only we had one, right? Okay, Altena this works, kind of sucks. I guess. It doesn't? Yeah, because we only need just... like 20 uh, times 2 from Nino. So oh, there we go, yeah. And works. then Rosada just takes the choke point, right? Yeah, I think so. Uh, Altena will have to hit, I guess, but if not, we can always just choke it with Rosado anyway. Yeah, Speaking well... Of which... Oh, yeah, we just choke it with Rosado anyway, okay. Yeah, uh, I guess we have to, like, do this and just wait. Because if we attack, Rosado dies, right? I think so, yeah. Yeah, because it's yeah. 17 and then the other mm -hmm. thing, and then 17 again. Okay, yeah, kind of yep. stinks. Unfortunate Unless, nice. can Ricard use the Leaven Sword? Yeah. I'm afraid not. And if you want, the thieves have, I think, base one weapon level, and they cannot grow it. It's very cute. Cannot grow it. They're going to steal a manual. <laughs> That's what they're going to do. We still have a manual. Okay, so now, no matter what wiki you follow, they will spawn. And they spawn Are here. Sure? I mean, I'm, I'm never sure anymore in this chapter. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. They have eight moves. So they reach... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. They reach Odin's square. So what we do is we put Odin like one back, I guess, and then hope that works out. Or geese. Do we let's like save point first in case we get it wrong, right? Yeah, I agree with that. Let's save point with Dorothy. Should be in range no matter what, so we can just yeah, do this. Yeah, exactly. And then just throw Odin here and move the Pegasus Knights back a little bit. Reequip their weapon. It could probably just give S to different lands than the only Rider's Bane. Or one of the two Rise Bane we have actually, Silver Knights. Perfect. That's right, give her the fire emblem. <laughs> there you go, let's go open some doors and chests. We can uh, make a purchase of some hand axes, maybe. I'm kind of low on those. Don't have them here. They can buy, you can buy Rider Spains here. Wow. I only just whoa, got whoa. two new ones, so I don't need them, but. Yeah, no. Cool. Imagine like recruiting us for this. So just buy one. <laughs> what a giant opportunity cost that was to do. I'll put uh, I'll put these here and we'll see what the enemies do. Uh, Oscar, keep going to that sniper, your mortal enemy. Do we actually have the key for this? Mm, it's on the way, <laughs> but okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. can't. It's not a great key user because he will be in that spot where the sniper just attacks him. So you bring up reasonable points that we might want to get another dorky over there with Pala. Surely, Oscar just one rounds right. I mean, like, Pala also just dies to it, but we don't care about Pala, you say, right? <laughs> That's true. Do you also not care about Ricard? Don't we have Julian still, or did something happen to him? No, nope, Julian is, uh, well, alive and good. All right, we all right. could have Micaiah buy a key, though, and then trade okay. it to Pala, and then Pala can help out. Or rather, we, we just uh, kill Oscar, right? We, we end up losing both thieves on accident, and then, like, you know, mysteriously, a new Patreon will come up and submit, like, Calm or something to the late game. <laughs> just out of nowhere. <laughs> Like, man, yeah, no, this guy just has a joke, decided what if Colm joined in the late game? <laughs> hey, All right, here they come. Just in time. And uh, Rosada will have to not crit again. What did I tell what you? What did, yeah, I don't know. Why did, why did I even bother, right? Odin Dank, about to not get doubled, thanks to his speed wing use, right? Right? 
Rosado will dodge and we'll be we'll be all right. Rosado always dodges. We're going to take the dodge. Hopefully that wasn't meant for someone else. Rosado always dodges. 66. Incoming! Nope. No, Rosado. I did, did not, not run. run. He did not dodge. Rosado, he's too good. He's too good. Okay, but they did come here. One, two, three. We didn't four, see that this six, works, right? Eight. And they have no see. javelins. Wait, what? He does have a javelin? What happens? The back one did. He attacked Odin. Did he miss? Yeah, yeah he did. And he would have he would have tanked it though. He would have tanked it. Okay, yeah. We're fine. So the yeah, plan this works. is a good spot to put him. And they are fast enough to double geese. <laughs> so good thing we didn't use him. So Yeah, for real. Yeah, Odin is like one of the few people who can actually tank them. And they're gonna keep coming for a while too. But one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay. So the javelin comes from the back spot, and they will never be able to attack the person behind him. So we can't just put like a healer behind him and be fine. But it will be hard to get the bow kills this way. Well, bow kill can just go from geese to square, right? Yes, you're right. We don't need, we don't need geese to square. Okay, let me let's set that up, right? Yes. Okay, surely he won't crit again. Surely Rosada will not crit this armor knight for the fifteenth time. My child will not crit the armor knight. Okay, he dodged this time. All good. All good. We're good. Oh. Yeah, Rosada dodged anyway, so we're fine. <laughs> Right, Odin critting also wouldn't matter. It's fine. Our boy is fine. Our boys are fine. Dragoon. Yeah, that's it's a very intimidating name. I think that's the name of their squadron, like the Macedon Dragoon. I remember the yeah. boss like gets mad. It's like, why did they send the freaking Pegasus Knights? I want some I want some real steel. I want some strong men. I don't want Pegasus Knights. Ugh! Pegasus Knights. Disgusting. To be fair, these Pegasus Knights like can't even kill a mage. That's their whole job. I mean, it's not just any mage, it's Odin Dark. I mean, well, yeah, but these aren't just any Pegasus Knights for the Macedonian Dragoons. Okay. Like, your point is fair. Oh, I really want to save this priest for... Oh, can we do this? Like, just stand here for a turn and save this no, priest? No, just hand axe him. Yeah, I could just hand axe. If he moves away, he will die. Like, if the priest is smart enough to move away, then he will die to Rosado. I'm trying to feed it to Nino. Wait, how will the priest die to Rosado? The only way he dies to Rosado is if we attack him with Rosado, right? Yeah, so uh, I think if I attack the Armor Knight, I, I phrased that incredibly. If you attack the Armor Knight like this, mm -hmm. and the priest moves away while healing him, I'm actually not sure how much he would heal in that case. I mean, how much are we really getting, like... Like, how much EXP are we really getting from this guy onto our fe one S? That's a good question. I mean, S is level 5, so there's, there's some EXP in there somewhere. Speaking of which, check out the trade chain. Whoa! Whoa! Get EXP Whoa. for trading? I, I, would, I, I would get so much EXP for that, holy shit. Let's check it out! Go, Ooh. Felix! Kaboom! You know, before we just get that we hit him twice if he goes here. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. In and then we just say, no, we actually just, just surround him and that's ST XP, right? <laughs> Everything is ST XP. Uh, except this guy, he's going to Dorothy. Please hit. Thank you. Dorothy attacks the fire with a steel bow, and we pray she hits. Nothing has changed. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's all accurate to the FP6 experience. Uh, do we have like this sword hand here and then trade it around again? That's like the only clean way to do this, right? Because Barcher just ends up in a very scuffed spot if he goes in here. Mm -hmm. There's like one thing we could do where we just like attack it and then go directly left with Odin, and that actually blocks out everyone's ability to attack Bartray, but then on the next turn, all the Pegasi are to the left, and we're in like the same position, but we just keep on going deeper into yeah, the, like, Yeah, it gets worse hallway. and worse. Yeah, and this is the only spot where I can heal Odin uh, with Micaiah without her dying to the Javelin, mm -hmm. I think. Uh, I think we'll just sort hands once. An arrow spade to Ooh, kill, which I guess we is a have nice one. backup. But, I mean, Odin has honored hit, so who cares? Well, we have it, so I don't use it, right? Yeah, we could just use the arrow, but Odin Dark. He's his levels before this. He's probably, he's probably more than next, right? So, yeah, probably. It's getting that massive Sorcerer level ups. Odin. Sword hand. That's where it turns out they actually edited it in the Dark Knight class. <laughs> oh wow! I wish. I wish so badly. All right, nineteen magic heal coming in. You know, I was complaining about. Oh, I, I forgot to swap in. I. Oh no. Is this okay? Well, he takes fourteen and eleven, right? He should be fine. 
Yeah. I, if that's what you say he took, then I'm, I'm, I trust you got the numbers right. This means there will probably be no kill for Dorothy next turn, though. I mean... But there will be two kills for Odin, so, like, how bad can it be? That's true. Even better. True. We're gonna promote Dorothy and see these massive female sniper games, right? Like, exactly. surely. This class is just lit. It's true. We don't really have uh, a sniper besides Shinon. We had George, but, you know, an unfortunate skiing accident happened to him. <laughs> I think Dorothy honestly needs to support more than using this out, out of here. Let's, let's give, keep Marth here. And Altena, good luck. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> He's just trying to grind XP too. How do you still have crit on everyone, Mr. Sniper? Jeez. Well, what are we going to do about this guy? What if we retreat and still try to trap him? Well, he's on low HP now, right? We could probably kill him with the Silver Lance. Sword Hand! Can't. But what if we kill him with the Silver Lance from Est? True. I guess if we just run away, then he's just going to just steal or chase us, and both of those allow us to kill him with Est. Mm -hmm. That works. I'm down. It's not like Est is going to get these Pegasus Nets kills anyway. Sword Hand! I don't. Bam, ba da da Oh, you know what? I'm, I like that level up, actually. You know, yeah, I'll take it. Hot take, I'll take it. We might need to physic him. No, he's still fine. He should still be fine. Yeah. We can, uh... Well, we still need to trade over something, so... Or... Just do this, Item right? command, I guess. Yeah. Vulnerary, yeah. maybe? Who knows? Yeah. I guess at some point he will have to fall or I have to physic, so I'd rather spend the vuln than a physic. We have, like, mm -hmm. what? Two more turns of this? Uh, through 15. It's actually, like, quite Damn, a lot. Damn, that's so much better. like, six XP. turns. Okay, we take it, we take it. We take that grind. We're on that grind. Uh, can S one of priests? Nope. <laughs> that's that's a work in progress. Uh, we can well, just take out the armor with Nino, right? And then we're good. I think so, yeah. And we're ready for the S grind. Alright. Thunder! Nino momento! I haven't enjoyed using Nino this much since the Nino percent race. I also haven't oh, used yeah. Nino since the Nino percent race. Oh. What if it's just like enjoyable yeah. to train Nino? Yo, trade the javelin over and start using that for the priest. Oh, oh, you know what? I'll take it. Altena's not doing anything anyway. EXP it is. Altena Run, you has priest. now been usurped by Est. Do you think we're Fire Room streamers? What, training Est? No, well, that too, but also. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that too. Okay, all solid. Uh, Pala's done her job. We just need... Oh, we need to leave this sniper alone until we're ready for him. Uh, he doesn't match mm -hmm. Felix's move, so we can't just run away towards Est. Okay, let's do it. Yeah, he'll attack Felix, but like, oh no. Just, no, he won't, uh... right? Because Felix... Oh, right, Felix is still in range because of two range. I guess Felix can get crit because he, he is like... Not the amazing best, best uh, ever. Wait, what if Felix runs to the right? Because if we, if we run to the left, then what happens is the sniper ends up on that uh, corner square and we can't trap him. I guess we could just keep running from him, right? Like, who cares? So where do you propose we go here? Uh, I was thinking about there, but then I was like, wait a second, that just doesn't even work either. So let's just go like to the far left. Okay. I think if we just get some more units over there, we can definitely trap him somewhere. Just not this yeah. turn. And we need to unequip the two range. So I guess, yeah, still get attacked, that's okay. Ala can help with the trapping him if he's surroundable, but if not, she can just run away. And I suppose Altena can do the same. And this has to be a very precise operation with all these flyers in here. Yeah, we need like five units to trap a sniper. Yeah. There aren't even five squares around any enemy in the yeah. game. Like... We should be good now, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Bring the Pegasi. Mm -hmm. Don't crit me also, please. I beg you. Thank you. That is not surroundable, but we can now run out of his range completely with Felix. Yes, and then he is surroundable. He will be surrounded. It's already a fact. Maybe Odin should use Thunder so that Dorothy can use a weaker weapon or a more accurate one. Hmm. Well, we can use Parthia, which is more accurate, but it's also Parthia. We're also about to like break the fire to him anyway, so yeah. also trying to heal or something, like Yeah. Uh yeah, I guess Breeze is healing AI, but not the way you think. Mm -hmm. It's probably better to kill him first. And then fly back, right? Just uh I don't know. I guess he's just gonna chill there. Yeah. Whatever, I'm just gonna kill him because I see the numbers right now. Come here. You're mine. Should be easy. War crime incoming! Oh. Est's first war crime. Yay! Congrats, Est. Huge benchmark. 
okay, I guess we're doing Porthia. Porthia was made with this purpose in mind, right? That's right. That Still and Kelly Medeos have the last use. Yeah, of course, of course. Couldn't forget. I think I'm about to need a new mend. Oh, I should have messed up the swap again. Oops. Oops. Two more kills for Odin. Actually, <laughs> Minus two sword hand for Odin? I mean, you have Star Sphere, right? Surely. Eventually, we will have Star Sphere. I guess Arrow Sphere, actually. And then Odin we're going to just be fire. using Star Sphere on Porthia, and I'm actually going to cry. <laughs> I'd say I was so wrong. Aerospace. <laughs> Jakey level. Gotta get that Jake EXP, right? That's true. Skill, strength, HP. Not too far off. Alright, break that fire tone, Odin. I believe in you. And then the sniper. Yeah, everyone can just run. I'm. Okay, Julian is fine. We do need to be a little bit precise about how we run away, maybe? Because I'm actually not sure if Felix can get out of range anymore. With Ju and Rickard as well. Uh, well, if Felix lives, then we run with Rickard, right? So. Yeah, but Felix does not, in fact, live. Unless he well, falls. he has a Vuln, right? Yeah, true. Okay, we just Vuln, I guess. I, f I thought he had run out of Vuln earlier, but he didn't. Uh, keep these guys, like, kind of close by, I think? Or, no, Yeah, fine. maybe that's... What you're doing, Maybe that was too far. Okay, Felix, use Vuln. You don't get crit, thank you. Oscar dies to a crit as well, so it doesn't really matter who stays in range. That's true. Okay, so next turn he'll be... Hmm, I wonder if that's close enough. But I don't have any high move units left, so I guess maybe we have to use Warp or Rosado. But we have Rosado, so here you go. Yeah, we have Rosado. It's like 10 units here, I think we'll be able to surround a sniper. <laughs> yeah, eventually we'll manage. Okay, Odin has the fire, we should be good. Sniper gaming. All that. Yes, it's gonna get like the, poor, the worst level ups ever, with the, even those 70% growth. Like, I'll think I did, so surely yes, will as well. She'll get luck defense, that's right. If we're lucky. Oh, I think if Marth doesn't have a man in the combo, I should buy one with someone with full inventory. Oh, true. Is this a uh... no men in the combo? I thought the shop only sells heals or oh, does maybe, it sell maybe you're right. Maybe Odin will have well, some bone. Just heal a bunch. Dun, dun, dun. Let's, Let's go, Dorothy. Oh, let's go. All right. Strength, speed. Let's get it. Nearly double digit. And by nearly, I mean like we're three away. But, you know. Yep. No men's. Maybe. How bad can it be? Maybe. Nope. He doesn't have one either. Um, can we get away with just healing him? No way, right? Oh, we can. Wow. Mend is not necessary. What the fuck? Mend bad? Insane. Sword hand. I'm going to do the trade, trade command. command. Yeah, I'm going to do the trade command correctly this time. These hands are made for trading. Let's go grinding session. Micaiah looking at Odin's inventory. Down, sword hands. I'm like, I don't know, I've got nothing. <laughs> Basically. Okay. Uh, implements surroundations. Go Altena. Go Felix. And go... Maybe he can go get Chez treasure. That's right. And you can go surround. Good job, There's always the most disrespectful strat in Fire Emblem. Like, <laughs> yeah, really? For sure. <laughs> it looks so silly too. Okay, Est, I got a present for you. And it has Get in there. XP. And then Jake was like, nope, my XP. <laughs> Est's just like, promotion is instantly better than Altano. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Not the most difficult accomplishment, but yes. <sighs> Absolutely. Okay, I think very shortly we will be in the like, Pendreo needs to heal Odin 2 territory. Yeah, we should be close to that. Which is difficult. Which more is there? Like two more turns of reinforcements? Three? This is turn 13, 13 so yeah. it's 13, 13 14, 14, and 15. Yeah, yeah so three more. Yeah, because if Micaiah heals, he goes back up to 21. Yeah, he can Vuln though. He can Vuln. Oh, true. What do we do about the uh, Javelin? Uh, Jake. Oh, yeah, of course. We have that guy. That guy is always there for us. He's going to hit. He's gonna have to hit though. Or we sword hand heal Physic. Even more expensive. Or we spend Forged Aerospace. Oh. Well, he missed, so... Looks like uh, it'll be some physics shenanigans. Sword hands! Don't let me down! 
please. Please. It's okay, we get Hummer and soon Copium, like. Took the 20, it's only like five maps away, six maps, seven maps. Seven oh, maps, yeah. So good. Helium. And Ezekium. Um, lots of candidates here, and there's Hogan. Perfect. And Estium. Right, you're here, right? Yeah, you're here. Okay. Alpena, move out of the way now. And Est. Get a Mest. Oh, perfect. Perfect. And she crits anyway. Nope. Easy. Money time. Surely it's money time. Let's maybe take care. Oh, does oh, there's a color bow, so we can't just grind Linde on him. But wait, how much speed they have? <laughs> Wait, only three res? Yeah, what a game. Doesn't Nino just one around him or no? Is he fast? Wait, hmm. 13 speed? Nope, Nino is hella good. She'll have to hit though. I mean, just hit, right? Come on, just how bad can be? Let's send over. I kind of like Mars supports here, but I also want to send over my can opener. With Dark. With Whoa. Andre. Let's just do that. Let's do this. Can opener. Out of the way. Yeah, it makes sense. We could even like uh, swap out Rosado and Oscar, maybe. Oh, we yeah. Decide we need more firepower. Yeah, I like that. Here. It's like, oh, I'm going to get free. No. 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 No, you don't. It's not how move order works. Golly, farming the reinforcements <laughs> here. I wouldn't got more XP from chipping Pegasus Knights than from killing enemies in this chapter almost. Yeah, pretty much. I, I'm beginning to see Jewel's point about not wanting the, these Pegasus Knights on the field. They make the enemies way stronger. Uh, yeah, no, it's like, what the heck? Dorothy! It, it's kind of like the, the Fire Emblem, if they just, uh, like, if Alter just decided to actually go and kill them as opposed to letting them get away, right? Like... Oh, yeah. Busters are so fun. Do we need a new Tome for Odin, by the way, or no? should almost exactly work out, right? Yeah, I, I think you're right. This is, like, exactly enough. Yeah. Okay, let's see the hit rates from Nino. They're not fantastic, but, like, they're okay. If we, like, if we can have an insurance policy, it's fine, probably. Yeah, it makes sense. If we don't, it's not fine. How is Rosado? Damn, Rosado is Rosado, <laughs> all right. He just does it, turns out. Like, yeah, he, he does have to hit, but, like, Nino will hit one out of two, and then... Rosado hits one out of two, and then Bartra will hit one out of one, and we should be, should be all good. One out of Bartra hits one out of one. <laughs> okay, uh, let's get the sniper kill. That's the best. We sure baited that sniper out pretty far. Yeah, no. Oh! oh dude. <laughs> <laughs> was that everything she could level up? I think she I had zero magic, so. zero res. I think so. That's definitely the FU1 special is zero magic. Wait, the silver zero. card? What were we yep. doing buying any of this card? Oh, true. Well, in order to get there, we kind of needed to buy stuff. <laughs> but, okay, yeah, that's true. True, true, true. I think our forges are not any less expensive now, but random weapons will be. Mm -hmm. As far as we need those anyway. All right, we should, we're good to end turn, right? Uh, yes, should be. Just always get paranoid about this part because I've grinded on Ambush Forms many a time and had to reset over it many a time as well. Because Ambush Forms can always mess you up in some way. You can't really counter ranges unless they're on the yeah, field. Yeah. And if they're on the field, it's usually not productive to counter ranges. They should just die. Oops. Uh oh. I'll just grind these out real quick. Kill with the Porthia. So much Dorothy Stongs coming in. Is it level 10? Oh, she's almost, oh, she's almost level 11. Let's go. And then we... Mm. I hope Raisins isn't about to get, like, evicted or anything. Just throw this one at him. We don't need that many arrow spades, right? Right? Just hammer in it, right? Right? Okay. Jake is now harder to double. Deal with Odin. Stick with 
the thunder, 20 magic, 12. Oh, Micaiah. So 20, good. 12. But... All right. Oh my goodness. You good? You're not losing your home. No police at the door. All right. Sounds like developments are still ongoing. Um... An opener? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Surely he'll hit, right? Wait, I actually don't know if the boss stopped reinforcements, so maybe this. Oh no. Oh no. It's okay, we have physic. We have physic. We can go him. We can go him. Okay. Maybe we do have to do the Rosado hit, though. So we have physic? We do have physic. Okay. Yeah, I think I'll physic him. Archery. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Nice. All good. All good. Yeah, no, it was the guy who I thought it was the fire inspector, but no, it was the guy who was telling me that the fire inspector will be at my apartment, at my apartment next. And then I go and sit down, and immediately the fire inspector is here. I'm like, man, that was fast. <laughs> nice customer service. Very fast. Yeah, no, I, well, that was prompt. Okay, so what's going on here? We oh, we missed a hammer, but yeah, I missed the hammer, and I decided if I want to feed Nino, you know, I need and I can't ensure that I will survive the turn. So it's just physical archery. Okay, makes sense, yeah. And, and then I was just, also like, like, hit him one more time. If I kill the boss, maybe the reinforcements won't appear. And that's Ooh. Well, I mean, they did. Yeah. But, oh, if you well, had killed them earlier. Yeah. Bartre! Ooh! Easiest Nino kill of my life? Yeah. And we've had plenty of easy ones, so that's like a low bar? Very low bar? That's right. Nino's a pretty good unit. Oh, that A ranked Tomes on our boy Odin. And our void was that plus one attack, or that's like the same as the lances, yeah. Yeah, it should be the same tree, same table, same yeah, 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 same category. Only. Yeah. He just keeps using sword hand all the time. He doesn't wow. care. Oh, it doesn't build wax for what? It does build whip. It's just I don't know. I guess we never really had to notice his rank, I guess, because it's always accurate, and he doesn't use anything. Oh, true, else. yeah. Anyway, I will use another one of these because uh, airspace is getting a little low. So that was the worst part in Fire Emblem, where your weapons early on, where you're using them at first, like, ah, I have 40 uses of rapier, it'll be fine. And then as you go on, it's like, oh, here, well, I only like have eight. 10 uses. Like, mm -hmm. Well, it's like, I've, I've only got 10 uses, but my unit, like, kicks butt otherwise, so, you know, how bad is it, really? Yeah. Well, I don't know how much Odin does, like, he doesn't do a whole lot of one running without the Excalibur. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Damn, Dorothy's on fire, let's go. Her, her yeah, stats are still bad, but the level ups were looking good. <laughs> yeah, no, like, she has improved greatly. <laughs> You know, there were growths at play. She's earning the most improved uh, trophy. Um, okay. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right. Oh boy. Thus falls the mighty kingdom of Gra. Gra moment. Oh my goodness, come on. We're getting there. And we have another Master Seal. Let's go. We can promote Bartray. can't promote anyway. Can promote... How bad can it be? Ooh, Odin, Odin, obviously, do, right? Do we promote Bartray? Or Odin? Odin, oh, Odin. Yeah, Odin, true. Yeah. Odin, dark. Yeah, come Odin on. Dead. He's like one more level. Hmm. Just 18 more EXP ratings, 18 more. That's all I want, is 18 more EXP. Yeah. This better Surely be there's player. no surprise reinforcements, right? Yeah. It's it's after the wiki's time, and... Um, after the fandom and wiki's the, time. And the bosses died, but come on, there shouldn't be any more, right? There's no way we just physic anyway. Yep. <laughs> For EXP, I'm right? not throwing this, I'm not throing this away. Yeah, no. Not for the world. Okay, Not this excellent that. kill. We just killed all the dragoons, by the way. Like, yes. how do you think Est and Power feel? Like, never liked those people anyway. That's why we deserted. Yeah, no. <laughs> they were always like bullying me in the in boot camp. Yeah, though no, all sixteen of those dragoons just <laughs> deserve to die. Like, apparently, did you just do the math on how many reinforced? <laughs> uh, I mean, yeah, I think so. Eight through fifteen. That's eight turns. So, well. That was it for the Land of Sorrow. Surely a happy occasion, uh, either because we beat the Sorrowful Land or because it's we're we're happy that we're. That's I don't know where I'm going with this, but next I don't is, know. And next is desert. <laughs> next is <the laughs> desert. So we'll see you for that one. Bye. See you next time. Yeah.